I took an AP chemistry class in high school my junior year and it went really well and I had a lot of fun with it and it was just one of those subjects that kind of clicked for me right off the bat. A lot of people struggle in a class like that whereas for me it was sort of natural. I really enjoyed the class and I enjoyed learning about all the stuff that we talked about. Kind of from that point on I started thinking well maybe I could do a chemistry major and then it was well what do I do with that afterwards. I sort of came in as a chem major, kind of unsure of what I would do afterwards, probably like a graduate school or something like that. But then I met a few people who were on the pre-med track as well, and so that sort of pushed me in that direction to double major with the chem and the pre-med. I think I like a challenge in all aspects of life. I'm just a, I'm a very competitive person by nature, sometimes to a fault. I kind of take it as a personal challenge, you know, to be the best that I can be on the soccer field, the best that I can be in the classroom. and. Um, Sometimes I'm competitive with other people, but I would say more so I'm competitive with myself and holding myself to the highest standard possible. So that's, it kind of carries over both in the classroom and on the field. For soccer, I mean, it's again, it's just winning that uh, tournament championship. You know, last year was such a disappointment winning the regular season and then going down in the first round to the lowest seeded team, it was pretty, pretty disappointing. And it was a shock to us because we weren't ready to be out of the tournament yet. Um, and so for these seniors especially, they've put in so much time, so much effort. I mean, if I ever need any motivation, I just look to my co-captain, Leah. She has put in so much work for this team and I can tell how badly she wants it. And so one of my biggest motivators is just not letting her down and just getting her and the rest of those seniors, you know, that championship that they deserve and they've worked so hard for the last four years. So that's gonna be our biggest goal going forward for the season. You know, ever since she's been here, as a, even as a freshman, it was uh, very hard not to give her a leadership role. And you know, for a, for a, a freshman to come in and take a captaincy was it's pretty tough to do. But she came actually very close to doing that. And um, we held it off for the freshman year. But once she's uh, like into a sophomore year, you know, she got the captaincy and has just been a leader ever since. Um, inspiration for all of the players and, and basically uh, leads by example. I think it's been kind of a season of ups and downs and sort of a test of our character of, you know, are we gonna be the team that can do it? I think we absolutely have the potential, um, the talent and the heart come tournament time. You know, it's a matter of how bought in is everybody and how much does this mean to us to, you know, be the first team to win that MAC tournament championship, go on to the NCAAs, because no one's done it before at Ball State. So I think that's gonna be our driving force to get us there and do what no team's done before. Thank <laughs> you.